Hey, hello everyone, welcome back. So, you know, today's tutorial we will see how to create an shopping application in by using Android Flutter. So, as you can see, this is our demo application. First, you will get the splash screen here, and this is our splash screen. And after this, here we are having a login screen. So, here we can enter email address, and here we can enter password. And we are having the button of create your account. If you click on this, we can see the registration form here. If I click on back and then uh, if I click on forget password, we are having this type of design for uh, to reset the password or, or you can just uh, enter your email address to get the new password. And if you click back again, as you can see, we are having social handles at the bottom, Facebook, Twitter and Google. And now let's log in into our uh, application. Let's click on login. And as you can see, this is a shopping application. From here, we can buy a house or a row houses or bungalows from here, right? We are having a list of houses from different areas with different names. We can select here area from these chips, Mumbai, Delhi, or Ahmedabad, any one area. And we can also search here for Pune or any other city you want, right? So this was our dashboard. Then we are having search section, which is coming soon. It not has been done. This part is pending. We are having the profile section. As you can see, the, here is the uh, profile picture of the developer. Harsh Bausar is her, his name. We are having two buttons here, chat and follow. And here bottom, uh, here we can see the list of all the uh, uh, posted houses. If you have having any followers, followings and likes uh, are there. Then we are having fourth op option as setting. In setting, we are having uh, all these options. Uh, to change our personal details, logout, login, and all this stuff. So this type of UI design, I'll share the source code of this type of application in our today's tutorial. So this was our demo application. Now I'll show you how to get source code of this application. So you just need to go, go to Chrome or Safari and search for this project Shutter UI collection, which is created by Hush. Uh, I have the GitHub ID is iHushB, and this project has been created by two years be before and uh, this whole project is in that like flutter so here are the screenshots of uh, all the like uh, uh, screenshots of uh, this project so i forgot to show you the this uh, uh, this uh, onboarding animation of this application so i'll show you just give me a minute if you minimize this one let's come back to our demo application and let's the un uninstall this application and go to our uh, project i am using uh, vs code to run this project this is the source code of our project as you can see ui services all the model classes are here and this is a flutter project let's run the project and i'll show you that onboarding animation as well it may take some time to run So our application is up and running. This is our splash screen. Then it will show us the onboarding animation. So as you can see, this is the onboarding animation. You can swipe right, or you can click on next button at the top corner, right? So this three are our uh, onboarding animation. And if you click on done, it will come to login screen. So uh, this is the application, and here is the source code. So here you are having all the uh, screenshots of this project. And time by time, the user will update uh, more UI designs into this, right? So as you can see, our uh, that uh, profile screen has this type of post at the bottom. But currently, we are not having any post, so in application, it shows us the empty. And uh, yeah, that's it. So you, uh, to run this project, you just need to uh, click on here and download this zip file, and then open it in VS Code on Android Studio, and your project will be up and running. If you face any uh, query or any problem while running this project, please comment in comment box or you can also mail me. Uh, hope you like this tutorial and thanks for watching.